We have approximately uh, 600 professional drivers that I'm responsible for and approximately 500 tractors and 1,400 trailers. We're unique. We're a poultry company. We, we go on private ground, public roadways, dirt roads. We're not just point A to point B. Prior to dry camp, we gauged how we were doing out on the road due to accidents, how many accidents we have during the year. We wanted to find out what was causing these accidents. So we brought in drive cam and it's been able to tell us what led up to the accident and we can change the behavior of the drivers and hopefully prevent accidents in the future. I've been a local driver for 19 years and the traffic has really increased. So you really have to be aware of your surroundings and make sure you're doing a good job and paying attention. Even though they pass a hands-free law, you can look down and there's two out of three people doing it. It's brutal out on the road. They're, when they're driving through a metropolitan city, you have a lot of commuters, a lot of people cutting you off, texting, using their phone. I mean, so our drivers really have to be aware and be very defensive. Now they know that we're using this tool to have their back and make sure that um, we can provide evidence to show that um, you know, they weren't at fault in, in certain accidents. One of the things that's key for Foster Farms is our safety. They want to make sure our drivers have a good, safe work environment and that they're also trained to be safe. And uh, that's a real critical thing for our president. Our driver was heading westbound on a two-lane highway doing about 55 miles an hour. And you can see a car approaching in our lane. And our driver pulls off to the shoulder as far as he could go without overturning his truck and the car goes underneath of our trailer. Without drive cam, it was, there was no witnesses around. We wouldn't have known what happened. And so it was a huge asset and to give us that story that we never would have had before. When we looked at uh, drive cam originally, uh, we, we noticed that we needed a trial run. So we used 40 cameras in different divisions and we got good results. And we are now seeing, since we've gone live in January, that our actions have gone down over 35%. We have a moral and ethical obligation to have safe drivers and safe equipment on the road. Drive cam is saying what the behavior is and to change behaviors you coach. And if it's from unsafe lane changes, following too close, the things that are benchmarked historically as causing accidents, we, we bring them in, they look at the video, they understand it, and our purpose is to prevent it from happening again. When the drivers first found out about drive cam, that we were bringing it into the trucks, they were worried, they were nervous, they thought it was kind of a big brother type of situation. There was some pushback because they didn't quite understand it, but now that it's been explained to them, they, they've seen the end results. I was a little leery of drive cam when they first installed it in our trucks, but I tell you what, after the accident I was involved in, I am 100% for the drive cam. I had a car veer, a U-turn right in front of me, didn't even look, and just slammed right into the side of me. And without the drive cam, he could have done a lot of different, said a lot of different things, but with that there, that was black and white. I think that it's really proving to be a tool um, to help provide evidence, um, you know, that they were doing the right thing. We installed the drive cam system in our trucks, and we use that as a, as a coaching tool to change behaviors that we may be able to help them with through over time. When we go through coaching sessions uh, with the drivers, they can see what they're doing wrong um, real time and we can give them quick feedback. I do not talk on a cell phone anymore. If there's a phone call, I wait till I'm at a stop position where I can receive the message. Drive cam is a great tool to have. It helps correct behavior. Uh, it helps you in the case of an accident if it isn't the driver's fault. It's changed the culture and the behavior of our drivers and I don't know if that there's anything greater than that that we can get from it. In the end, it's going to help you reduce accidents. You're going to get better drivers out of it. They're going to buy into it, take ownership. I would tell any other drivers that had a issue with the drive cam not to be worried. It's only filming when there's an incident and it will protect the liability against yourself and your company. It's an investment in, in your people and in your company. I would recommend it to any company that's looking to reduce their accidents and, and know the causation of accidents and, and make it a better, safer place.